There are three things to fear of in GNOME. The ruthless Bastion Nochera, shell lag, and outdated graphics. Nochera isn't shell maintainer but it would be really fun if he was. We should pray and do our will, before opening an issue, and when the door is knocking, we were shaking in fear just on the thought it could be him. Lag is partially fixed. Usually everything is smooth, except when there is or some heavy IO operations, and I have noticed some lag when rendering stuff, on high CPU GPU usage. Now on graphics. Well, while there are lots of improvements on 3.36 release, Shell is still looking visually outdated. Not just because of the graphics and dead colors, but mostly because of the bad motions. But this video is about a new animation that really shows how things should everywhere be, and I'm telling you already you're gonna love it. So again, no new lock screen, and as I told you on my last video, they are going to come some more changes, and here they are. Check out this animation when we switch from input to clock, and tell me this isn't so absolutely perfect. Another change is the arrow button to switch to GDM user logins, was moved to the right bottom of the screen. And I can't show you this, but on GDM this is the place we now pick sessions, and anyway, all together looks nice and consistent. And on my previous video I may said I don't like the new GNOME lock screen, but when you add such graphic motions. Well, yeah. That's kinda cool now, and I hope to see such animations in more places.